Hey guys, Norm here with Southern Cards, and today I've got eBay mail. These are purchases I've made off of eBay, and all these are um, gold standard PC cards I've got. Uh, when gold standard come out, they're a pretty card. I'm just not going to pay that price for them. They've got some nice stuff in them, but... Hey, I'm going to get my PC cards that I've seen come out of all these boxes. I've seen multiples of these come out of the boxes. So, uh, I'm miss, missing a couple. Uh, I think AJ Brown, uh, RPA, I'm not going to get one of them. They're, every time I almost get one, it just goes up in price like ridiculous. I'm not going to pay for it all. I'll, I'll wait till it simmers down and uh, buy it later on, but it is a pretty card. But I do have quite a few of the others, and we're going to open these. I have done opened them because I've got a lot of other mail in here, too, to figure out which ones were all my gold standards. It ain't like it's a mystery package. If it was something mystery, we'd open it together. But I did order all these, so I, I kind of knew, knew they were coming. So, But we will open them and look at them and uh, see what we got. So here we go. All right, here we are, guys. Uh, in the back today, I got my 95, yep, 95 tops, all pro cards. Uh, in a past video, you watched me open up, I think it was nine or 10. It could have been 12 packs of uh, 95 tops. And uh, I got these three all pros out of them packs. I got a Rod Woodson, all pro. And I got a Dion or a Junior Seau All Pro. Nice looking cards. And a Dion Sanders All Pro. I mean, fresh out, out fresh out of the pack, man. They're in perfect condition. I'm probably going to end up putting these on eBay. Just put all three of them together. The really nice cards, I really like them. Uh, the '95 tops are not just—they're not a really fancy card. I mean, they're '95. What do you expect? I mean, you look at the '95 baseball cards; they weren't the greatest either. But enough of that. Oh, if you're not following me on Instagram, you need to find me and follow me. That way, you can get a hold of me. I post pictures on there i need to po start posting more probably but maybe i can get around to that i'm gonna have some times on time on my hands pretty soon but without further ado let's go ahead and start opening these i uh, kind of made me a cheat sheet over here that way i tell you what i paid for them all the shipping was pretty well standard you know anywhere from three to four dollars just to send a standard card uh this one come all the way out of minnesota but all these will be the gold standard. I like the cards, but I don't like them enough to pay that much for the packs uh, that you get. Because uh, very few people hit like really great packs. I mean, a lot of them were just kind of... I mean, a lot of people lost their tail ends buying, buying them. But they are beautiful cards. Uh, my first one is a Corey Davis. Well, get this stuff out of here. Corey Davis out of 99. Signature. Nice card. I noticed this one's got a little chip there. A little chip there, which uh, some people I believe had problems with damage with these cards coming straight out of the box. So I think that was these. It may not have been, been uh, one of the others. I mean, I think some of these got damaged too. It could just be where he put it in the sleeve. I don't know. But that is a nice card. 
We'll set it there. The next one, this one come all the way from North Carolina. I'm in Tennessee, so. This is a rookie right here, uh, Jeffrey Thomas. I don't know nothing about him, but uh, it is 171 out of 199 auto. Oh, the Corey Davis. That one cost me $8.39 on eBay. Uh, this Jeffrey Simmons, I got it for $1.50. And, you know, it was basic shipping. It was like 3 to $4, you know. So, that is a nice card. Not sure who he really is. A def defensive tackle. God knows I need some defense. But, all right, next one. This one's from uh, North Carolina, too. Let's see. Oh. oh, we got some extras. I got some extra baseball cards. I guess I put those in there to just, I don't know. Uh, I'll give them my daughter. She'll play with them. Anyways, the next one is. Marcus Mariota and Derek Henry patch card. It's 62 out of 149. I've seen a lot of people pull these. But it is a nice card. I gave... Uh, uh, I gave $1.50 for this thing. $1.50. These things were what? $170 a box? You get what? Seven cards? Something like that. I think it was something like that. Uh, it's going to be like, what, 20 something dollars? 20 something dollars a card if you averaged it out. Dollar fifty. I mean, uh, I'm just going to sit back and wait for them because they're probably, these single cards like this are going to keep going further down. I mean, I guess it's, I'm lucky I have uh, the Titans. Not a very popular team, not a very. Mariota and Henry and Corey Davis, they're they're not really expensive players like Baker or Mahomes or some of these other guys. So I guess I'm lucky I got a piss poor PC team, all right? But I've got another Corey Davis. And this one's just uh it's just a numbered card. It's two ninety nine. So well if I can get it out of here. I got this card, just to 99, beautiful card, 99 cents, 99 cents, so, let's see, next one, I got another one, Marcus Mariota and Derek Henry, uh, I got this one as soon as these things come out. It was the like first day they come out, second day. Somebody already had one on there. That was this one was five dollars and sixty cents is what I gave for this one. And like I said, I gave a dollar fifty for this one. So within a week, that's how much it went down. Uh, or nobody really cared about them. Uh, next package. This thing come all the way from, where is that, Maine? I don't know. That's what it looks like. He had it all bubble wrapped real nice. Cardboard, tape. It's another Corey Davis. Now, I gave, let's see, I gave, what did I read? $8.39 for one. And this is the one I got when it first came out, and it was nine dollars and ninety nine cents. So ten bucks for one, eight fifty for the other one, and it's to ninety nine too. They're exact same. But I do like my Corey Davis cards. 
I think he'll eventually be good once he gets a little time under him. This one's 28 out of 99. The other one's 34 out of 99. So, uh, I want to think I've got one more on the way. Uh, and I believe it was an AJ Brown. Not 100% sure, but anyways, that is my gold standard set. And it didn't cost me all that much. They may not, they're really not worth all that much, but to me, they're my PC. I love them. But I hope y'all enjoyed the video. I did. I love my cards. They're pretty in gold. And let's see. Oh, let me get you up there. I'll put them up there with my PC cards. That's just some of them. I got the rest of them in over here in that box right there. See, it says Titans. But till next time, we'll see you later.